This is another segment of Flashy Fashions Materials Guide. Today what we're talking about our sewing machine. Right now I have a Genome sewing machine and yeah, I'll tell you about this machine. So this is a cover and your machine should always come with a cover. So I'm going to take the cover off. Um, this is your actual sewing machine. So to start off, I'll tell you about the dials. These help you with your stitching and settings of the machine and they go from one to nine and right here is our display screen it tells you your settings and stitches and down here this little lever is for your speed for the slower you want to go the faster it all depends on if you're an expert or not now as i move up to the hand wheel this helps with the bringing up and down the needle and now i'll talk about the bobbin the bobbin is a very small little spindle. Um, this is our bobbin winder stopper. This is our bobbin winder spindle. And you can click it back and forth so when you're winding up your bobbin to stop it, that's what helps it stop and spin. Next I'll talk about our thread. So this is a thread stopper. This is our thread and this is our thread spool. And the stopper is just to help for when you're sewing your thread doesn't fly off. Um, now we have our thread guide. You take your thread and you guide it through the machine. So this is your guide. It has directions. Next, this is our face cover. You know, it opens, closes. This just shows you inside of your machine. And lastly is our thread cutter. So it's always located on the side of your machine. So you can easily cut your thread after making your Hi, welcome back to segment two of getting to know your machine. So, our first we'll talk about our take up lever. This is when, of course, you take your hand wheel, which helps bring up and down your level, which helps your needle to come up and down. Next, I have our thread tension dial. It goes from zero to nine. It says as strong as you want your tension to be with your thread. Next, as we move down, we have our up and down needle button. As I push the button, the needle goes down, up, down, up. Now I have our IMAX stop button and our back stitch button. These buttons will be used when you're stitching. Next, as we come down, we have our hook cover plate. And this is our hook cover, cover plate release button. Press the button, the hook cover comes open. Inside, you'll place a bobbin. That's when you're threading your machine. This helps you stitch. And to put the hook cover plate back in, all you do is just snap it right back. In. Next, we have our needle. So here we have our needle, and our needle clamp screw is located right here in the front. This is what loosens and tightens your needle whenever you have to change needles out or whatever you have to do. Now in here, this right here, this whole section is your needle plate. It has different measurements for whenever you need to line up your stitching. Next, I have my thumb screw, and under your thumb screw is your presser foot. The presser foot is what clamps down onto your fabric for when you're stitching. In the back, I have our press foot lifter. Right here, it lifts it up and down. And there, that's our machine.